Hey guys, so today I just wanted to talk about um, some e.l.f. products that I received. I ordered a bunch of e.l.f. products on Black Friday and I got them in like three or four weeks ago. And so I just wanted to go through and talk about some of them. I don't have all of them with me because I got them um, shipped to my school and now I'm home on Christmas break. So I kind of just took the products with me that I was the most interested in. Um, so I'm going to talk about those right now. Um, and yeah, I've really gotten to use a lot of these products because I only brought like a very minimal amount of makeup home with me because I didn't have the room to pack all my makeup that I have at school and bring it back home. Um, so I've really, really gotten a good idea of what these, um, products can do. So I just wanted to talk about those real quick and, um, yeah, let's get started. So the first thing, and this is one of the things I think I'm like the most happy with, I'm I'm really happy with this order. I really am. Um, but this is the Eyes, Lips, Face um, Geometric Eyeshadow Palette. And this is the sixth um, color one. There are like five different sizes of these palettes. Um, and what I'm hearing from YouTube is that kind of like the bigger the palette, the lower the quality that it is. And I actually ordered like one of the big, I think it's like 92 or 96 color ones. And it was horrible. Um, and that I left back up at school, but, like, I don't think I'll ever use it once. Um, but luckily I got a really good deal on it, but, so I didn't lose out on that much money, but really bummed by that. But this one is one of my absolute favorite palettes, and, um, if you're interested, um, they are selling these at Target, actually, in stores right now, and they're marked down, um, like, all their little e.l.f. holiday sets. So if you're interested in some e.l.f. products, especially ones like this, Go check out your Target as soon as you can. There were quite a few left at mine. Um, but I have used this probably 75% of the time since I've been home. And I have like so much new makeup here. Um, sorry, excuse the swatches on my arm. But um, I just really like it. Um, this color right here is a great, great brow bone color. Or, or, I'm sorry, not brow bone. Um, brow color. I can fill my eyebrows with it. It's great for blonde hair. As you can see, this dark brown color is super pigmented. Um, these other colors are nice and pretty and reflective. Everything's just gorgeous, super pigmented. It was $3. Um, at my Target now, they're down to $2.10. and like 10 cents, So go check these out. Love, love, love. And th this was limited edition, I believe, for the holidays. Alright, so let's move on to this. This is the e.l.f. HD blush, and I actually ordered, the color of this one is in headliner. Um, I actually had ordered probably three shades of this like a year, year and a half ago, and I really liked them, but they were super dark. I ordered some of the darker shades, um, so this time I ordered the lightest one, and it's gorgeous. They are so insanely pigmented. Um, you just need, like, the smallest amount, um, something like that amount would do both cheeks. It's crazy. So, um, if you have a darker skin tone and you really are having a hard time finding a cream blush that's really showing up on you, look at the medium to darker colors in the HD, um, Studio Blush because it's just gorgeous. It blends so nicely, but if you do have fair skin, I definitely stick to the two lightest shades, um, because it is really 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 pigmented but I love this it's really good for in the winter when you maybe don't want to add more and more powder to your face you kind of want more glowy look really pretty all right so this is the elf conditioning lip balm in SPF 15 this is the color um, mellow melon I like that it comes with like a little stopper in it a gorgeous color um, I have been really loving lip products lately, um, which is something that I've never been super into, but um, in the last few months I've been really into lip products, and this is just really pretty for when you want to add a little bit of color to your face, but you don't want to do something bold at all. Um, you don't need a mirror to apply this. Um, I wouldn't say it's like the best lip balm I've ever used, but it's definitely better than like applying a lipstick or something like that. But I definitely use this more as makeup than a treatment. Though I really, really like the packaging. I think it's really gorgeous and it looks a lot more expensive than it is. This is a $3 product. 
the one thing I don't like about it so much is as nice as it looks, it is pretty clunky. I'm going to go ahead. This is my Vaseline Lip Therapy um, lip balm that I use all the time. And let's just compare the size right there. It's like three times the size of this thing. But the product is about the same. So, as you can see on the back, there's quite a bit of extra packaging. So, that is my one complaint. Um, but overall, I would absolutely get it in other colors. So I just have to figure out kind of how I'm going to store it. My e.l.f. Cream Eyeliner, and I believe this is in the color, yeah, it's in the color black. This is probably my fourth or fifth one of these. I just love it. I think it's just as good as MAC Fluid Line. I just, it, it really does not dry out too fast for me. I've had one for probably like a year before and it was finally drying out. But for three bucks, love, love, love. Um, I just really like applying this with an angled brush and I just love the look it gives me. Really, really like this. Um, oh, and I've all, also used this on my waterline. I have it recently, but I have many times before and it lasts pretty well. Then I got this cream eyeshadow. And this is in the color bronzed. I am so impressed with this. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do a swatch of that. That's it right there. It's just this gorgeous bronze color. And I was such a sucker for the Maybelline color tattoos. What I like about this is how creamy it is. It's so much more creamy. Um, so I think it'll last a lot longer. And I'm really interested in picking up some other colors of this. It's so much easier to blend because of how creamy it is. I really, really like the Maybelline color tattoos. But I feel like sometimes when I put them on my eyes, they're just not very even. Because they're a lot thicker and um, I just really think that this is a great, great product, especially for the price of $3. Um, then I got this e.l.f. Matte Eyeshadow, and I've gotten so many, this is in Chestnut, by the way, I've gotten so many um, loose eyeshadows from them. I can do a whole video on that if you want. I probably have like 20 or 25. Um, but this is just a nut, it's a lot harder to find matte pigments, and this is just a nice matte, light to medium brown, and I feel like it's just the perfect color. I love putting it, um, in my crease, and it's just the perfect transition color. I'm so obsessed with it. You can put it all over your lid if you want for a really, really simple look, and this is just one of the best purchases I've made. I don't typically like single, kind of potted eyeshadows or single eyeshadows, I don't know. It's just a lot more convenient for me to use a palette, um, but I just feel like this is such an essential color, and I really love it. And um, using it as a transition color, I I know that um, pigment eyeshadows are a lot more messy than you know pressed ones. I'm gonna try to give you a swatch of this, um, but I think it's definitely worth it for this color because it just makes it so easy to blend out. It's just it's so flawless. So I'm going to go ahead and show you a swatch of that. That's just the brown. So it would be gorgeous on a lot of eyebrow colors too. It's just a very transitional color. Alright, and the last product I wanted to talk about was this e.l.f. Studio Blush in Pink Passion. And I've actually had this color before. It's just the most hot pink color ever. But it's totally, there it is right there. It's not showing up on camera as bright as it is in person. But it's just totally gorgeous to warm up your cheeks. Um, I love it this time of year just to warm up a look a little bit. And um, you definitely have to apply it with a light hand. But when you do, I think it's gorgeous. And it actually pairs really nicely with um, this cream blush in Headliner. Um, headliner is definitely not as bold as this blush, so I think it helps tone it down a little bit. Um, so if you want to see, um, a look using a lot of these products or anything like that, or you want to see the other e.l.f. products that I purchased once I get back to school, please just leave a comment down below and I would love to do that for you guys. Um, also if you would like, I would love to hear what some of your favorite e.l.f. products are so that I can check them out. Thank you so much and I'll see you all soon. Bye!